Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This no. is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die, or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Ha. Huh. So they had a fling for a change for medicine. Well, shit. That's why she was so keen on killing him so quickly. Pretty much using sex for trade for uh, medicine, in this case, to help his sister out. Damn. Let's go. But on that note, guys, hey, it's Darkson here. Welcome back to The Walking Dead. Uh, after making you guys watch two episodes, we finally figured what's on that third tape. And that makes all the more sense what's going on with Molly and that one doc. Ha! <laughs> right. Boop. Dead. Now let's see what's going on here. We have everyone accounted for except for, again, Jesus Christ! Molly! Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Who the fuck have you been? scared me. Sightseeing. I'll take that battery down. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. You lost it? I'm just kidding. Gee. Here you go. What's that? Nothing. His sister. You can quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? Yeah, probably. Because that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. Oh, gee. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or in their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. Oh, dear. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could, but in the end, I couldn't protect her. Uh. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked, how anything was better than becoming one of them, but I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late, before they came and took my sister away. Oh no. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? Bell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Why is the... Where is the axe? Jesus. Ben. Ben. Sorry, sorry. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Kenny and I still can't get okay. the door open to the armory. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. Wait. I found this. Wait, what? Uh, Ben? Where'd you, Where get, did you that? get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Damn it, Ben! Oh. Shit! Yeah, good shot. Wait, where'd you get a revolver? What the 
fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! And messed up again. <sighs> Dang this it, is man. my fault. All my fault. What the hell is he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Oh, crap. Penny, I'm so sorry. Don't. I'm so don't. sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Ben, we don't have time for this now. I'm sorry, we don't. can't do this anymore. He's got a right to know. Uh. Know what? It's been me all along, putting all of us uh. in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. As he kicked the door Wait a minute. down. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Oh, jeez! Kitty, lay off, man! Ben didn't mean for any of this to happen! Oh, crap. It was all just a mistake! I don't give a fuck! Nope. You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You got them both fucking killed! Nice group you got here. Yeah. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Ugh. Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. Oh, Wait, don't I get a vote? Of course she does. Of course you do. And it's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. Oh. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Ha! I've seen enough of Crawford to know that becoming like them is the beginning of the end. I vote Ben stays with us. Yeah. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a second? Oh! Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on! Well... Let's go have a sooner or later. So much for the armory. What's left of it? The heck a few it? rounds. That's it. Seriously? You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's gotta be a way out down here. Fuck. Fuck! It's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! Leg. 
Excellent. Go away. That should be fine. I'm not, apparently. Okay, there we go. Jeez. Oh. Ooh. Crystal, okay. Oh, the came from another end, too. Great. End time. Next. Swing. Bada. Okay, kick. Swing. Bada, bada. Swing. Oh. There goes the hatchet. Come on. It's all right, Clint. I'm fine. Barely. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? What do you go, mean? go! What do you mean by that? Up to the railroad. Ben? Ben, come on, let's go! Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him! Mm -hmm. uh, oh, jeez! Playing possum. Gee! Hey. Back already? Wow. <laughs> Took a dang nap. I got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind, but we had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Yeah. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Dang. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. Uh oh. This is bad. Yeah. Listen, man. About what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over it. There was nothing you could have done. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? A little bit. That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. I mean, you're not wrong in What sense. did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. 
And I know you want what's best for her, but this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. Okay. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, <gasps> take her back with me, to my people. What? We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, Thank I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? You're coming at me with a lot here, Vernon. I need to think it over. Of course, take your time. But I want you to think about some things. You're a good man, Lee. You've been protecting these people as best you can so far, and they look up to you. Rightly so. But it's different with a child. You might have brought her this far, but sooner or later she might ask you for more than you can give her. I'm sorry if that's hard to hear, but it's the truth. I appreciate it, Vernon. Let me think about it, okay? You do that. Wow. That... That's insane. Um, wow. That's a lot, to be honest. That could be for Clementine. It'll all be over. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. Maybe you should come with us after all? What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded, and I never did like the water. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. Listen, I'm uh. not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me? Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. I guess things end off nicely after all. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Oh. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. But, like, she also has to... Oh, dear. We didn't make a choice. <sighs> this is a choice. Let her go with Vern. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. I don't know what to do. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? I don't know. We'll figure it out. We always do. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. Ben's a good kid. I think he's just feeling guilty about some of the decisions he's made. He's getting to feeling like he's a burden on the rest of us. Yeah. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Crap. There may not be time, to be honest. I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. <sighs> I'm not lying. No. <laughs> oh, come on. Please don't. No. <laughs> Reach out? <laughs> Baby? Um... <laughs> oh, come on. Don't do this. Maybe she is better for Vern? Oh dear. Clementine? Do we sleep till morning? I don't see the water. Clementine? Time.
Walkie Talk wasn't there because he's put on a desk. Where's anyone? What happened? Clementine? Clementine! God. No. I swear. Come on, please. Her head. That man, the radio. Radio. Trash bins. This thing behind there. Oh! Blood. Wait. <gasps> oh, did he bit me? No. 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 Oh, fuck. Lee. Lee. You out here? Lee. I got bit. I got bit. Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. No. Lee. No. Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Show him. Whose blood is that? It's mine. Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. The hat. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Cooperation would be good. Clem may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clem in time. Come on. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do hey, this alone. Hey, Omi's walking. He's good again. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? Thank you. Thanks, you guys. Really? I appreciate it. Really. Ken has spoken up. Oh, no. Don't. Lee, man. You know I care about Clementine. And I am a Christian man. Don't I keep asking myself. Don't give me this. If this was me asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? Because there have been plenty of times when you ain't been. Kitty man, I'm begging you here. I can't do this alone. I need your help, please. Come on. You might not have been keeping score, Lee, but I have. Wow. And you've been looking out for yourself more often than your friends. Well, what? Maybe that's a good thing. Because you're on your own on this one. What the heck, Ken? What about you, Ben? I don't know. Whatever you think is best. Clementine's one of the few good things left in this world. She stood up for you and Crawford when Kenny wanted you gone. Don't you think you owe it to her to stand up for her now? Yeah. yeah. I owe her. I swear. Before this is all over, I'm going to show you I can do something right. I'll prove it to you. You'll see. Good. Okay, guys. We should go find Vernon. See if he took her. Let's head out. I'll get the boat out onto the river. Figure I can wait there until you get back. Or at least until nightfall. You're still going to take me? Even Ben? Yeah. We'll figure out what to do about that when the time comes. No. Let me guess. I probably Come on guys, Come on. let's go. I probably had to agree with Kenny all the way to get him to come with me, wasn't it? That's probably it. 
how to agree with everything he had to do to get him to come with me, wasn't it? Wasn't it? It's probably it. <clears throat> I'm not getting a break, am I? You know, that's probably what happened. I don't have Kenny with me, so because I didn't grill all his stupid choices. Wait, what? What? Where'd they go? They all just dipped. Where the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. To where? Vernon! Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here! All I want is the girl! Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt! Uh... Where are any of them? <sighs> yeah, I don't look so good. Yeah, that's a lot of walk. Oh, that's a lot of walkers. Oh, I don't think Lee's feeling good. What? Are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! The man that the talking before. Where have you taken her? This isn't Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Clear time's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Guess got it. Oh. Um. Huh. That's one way in a chapter. Um. Wow. Okay. Um. I did a lot of things to agree with the people. Ben was. It was Lee, Ben, and, uh, Vermin. That was, uh, Vernon, not Vermin. Vernon. Okay. Alright, there's more, I guess? Okay. So, this must be what people usually get. Okay, so, that one's for Ben not just being there, and then just being Ben. I don't know how you get Chris and me not to go with you. guess being an asshole probably helps. Because going with Ken's idea, then Ben and Ken, and then the entire group, and then just all meeting Krista, and then I got everyone but Kenny. I'm actually surprised it's... Uh, Ken and Lee, that is the highest percentage of all of this. That's really weird, not gonna lie. Um, that's actually different. And then 6% people let him go alone, which is really weird. Alright. I thought we were done, not gonna lie. Oh, jeez. One last chapter, eh? Lily, one last rodeo. Oh, gee. That's, uh... Honestly, I was always going to stop it sooner, but I guess I'm glad I did it, because I didn't know it was going to uh, end like that. I mean, heck. That's different. 
if things are heavy in this chapter, I don't know what's gonna be like in the next chapter. I'm not gonna lie. Also, would they give us uh, one last like next time on the Walking Dead? Because they usually do it for every chapter, so they might do it with this one to be honest. Hmm, it's questionable. So, okay, I think with can he go with me? I have to go with everything he did or goes with him since probably the first chapter. So, like, to saving Doc, to, um, killing Larry, um, arguing Lily, go with his side, and everything. I probably have to go with every single decision. That's, that's kind of hard, though, because, like, they make him look like the bad guy in that, though. Like, I feel like that's what they try to do, that make Kane look like the bad guy. Oh, wow. Not even a next time on The Walking Dead. That must be run the final chapter. Gee. Well, guys, this has been Dar this is Darkson. It's been The Walking Dead. And, um, we'll see you guys next time. I guess for the final chapter. Signing off.